Introducing Cheyenne's new 74-inch compact tractor snowblower, providing even more height at 27 inches high. With the industry's first concentric access design and other standard features, the 600CT puts the snow where you want it. For more information on the Cheyenne Compact Tractor Snowblower, visit CheyenneMFG.com. Well, unlike most egg dealerships where it's more important you have the room in the shop, primarily have enough shop space and a limited showroom, you know, you don't showcase much equipment at, a, at the egg dealership. We knew it was kind of reverse here. We needed to have a nice, welcoming, large showroom mm -hmm. where we could accommodate both our rental equipment um, and then the offering of lawn and garden equipment. So we wanted to make sure we had enough room up front with the ability to still expand should we need to um, with the shop. Which anytime you build a building, you know, six months later we were saying <laughs> it's not big enough, we should have built it bigger. <laughs> but we're going on, you know, twelve years now in this facility and just starting to look at doing some remodeling and doing some upgrading to this facility as well. So Yeah, we probably add on to the shop. You know, we, we can utilize some more shop space and give us the ability to do more, sell more service as well. Um, and probably just some aesthetic stuff on the, on the front side here. And Dave, you were just at Jackson, so mm -hmm. if you remember that, that's very similar to the way this store is laid out. It's a single slope building, same as this is. And you enter into the showroom, and then the parts is in that corner. Mm -hmm. We make people walk through all our merchandise to get to the parts department, kind of a merchandising trip. Typical retail. Retail, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And, uh, and and then with the shop on the uh, in the back and that's in the offices up along the wall here so it's a it worked well here and we kind of patterned it in jackson we just took and blew it up a little bit made it a little bit bigger and uh, because there we serve everyone under one roof for the time being but we did when we purchased land in jackson we do have enough land there and it was often our thought that we may build a separate rental location there at some point, take that part of the business out of the, the store, but we haven't done that as of yet. Mm -hmm. so. it's, it's constant promotion. I mean, when when you drive by from the road, if if you're not paying attention and you just look and you're automatically drawn to the, the large tractors and the combines, and it's a constant remarketing <clears throat> of ourselves every year. You know, cause People that come in here for the first time, oftentimes I'll hear, oh, I thought you were just a tractor store. Mm -hmm. You know, or I just never stopped here before. I thought all you had was big stuff. And they come inside and see, number one, the merchandise. Number two, the complete offering of other equipment we have. And they're very shocked. And it's just a constant reminder to me of how we have to keep our name out there and, mm -hmm. and really market ourselves. 